Alright, Lisa, so what'd you think about the Seek Your Mouthpiece? Oh, so, let me tell you. We've been diving a lot. Lisa has got uh, some new gear, and it's all working really great, but she's experiencing something that's pretty common. It's called jaw fatigue. Mm. So, basically, when the regulator's in your mouth, the only thing that holds it in your mouth is your teeth. You bite on, and then your lips wrap around the outside, just like a snorkel. And um, you have a hose that's kind of wanting to pull it gently away from your mouth. So people sometimes will experience um, they're tired in their jaw by the end of the dive. So I've noticed uh, on our first couple dives that Lisa has been holding on to the regulator because the discomfort of it pulling away. This is something that I've experienced a lot. Uh, when I first started diving, I was still very active in martial arts and I was always getting choked and punched in the jaw and um, I would experience a lot of jaw fatigue and discomfort. This is a C-Cure mouth guard and what this is is um, this is a moldable mouth guard. You actually dip it in hot water hmm. and then you put it in your mouth just like you would with the athletic mouth guard. You can see it's much larger than the mouthpiece that's already there. I've had really good experience with this. I highly recommend it. These are about 30 bucks on Amazon. These are not one size fits all. You need to make sure you check the reference chart and get the correct one for your brand of regulator. Uh, we have a size chart on the back. We have a Aqualung Titan regulator, and this says it fits Aqualung Titan. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna remove the zip tie, take this mouthpiece off. We're going to put this in boiling water and mold it to Lisa's mouth, and then we're gonna put it on. Then we're gonna go dive it, and she's gonna tell us how. Test it out, basically. Yeah, see what your experience is. I also have problems with the mask not sealing right here. Will this help with that? That's right, so we've discussed your mask not sealing here. So there's a few issues that cause masks not to seal. First, everybody's face is different. Uh, people have different contours, people have different uh, wrinkle depths, people have different facial hair. All of these things cause a mask to leak. So what Lisa's experiencing is when she puts her regulator in her mouth, your lips will kind of, um, yeah. when you put the regulator in your mouth, your lips push up. But then the mask has to sit on your the top of your lip to make the seal. So all of this pushing up is causing a bigger, uh, maybe a contour right there that allows water to seep in. So all of these things are considerations when getting gear and picking out whatever. I have facial hair, so uh, facial hair is a real big issue when it comes to getting your mask to seal correctly. Some guys that have a bigger mustache will actually put Vaseline or silicone goop in their mustache just to kind of help seal it. But um, it's the price we pay, I tell you. Teeth marks. So this is an Aqualung regulator. They actually do a really good job. The zip tie that they use is. down. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Thank you. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. so they used to use zip ties, and now they have this, like, it's kind of like a ratcheting zip tie. So the, the benefit is it doesn't have a jagged edge to cover. Yeah. Lisa, so what'd you think about the Seek Your Mouthpiece? Oh, so let me tell you. First off, it didn't push too much pressure up here on my mask. So, I mean, my lips were not pushed out too much. That was perfect. Uh, the other part is my jaw isn't as tired. Um, I'm getting used to diving, but it wasn't that much pressure back there. I loved it. Highly, highly, highly recommend it to anybody else who would like, um, who's having trouble with their mouthpiece. Thank you everybody for watching Sailing by Felicia. We want to give a huge thank you to all our Patreons out there who've been supporting us so far. If you also like to support our channel, please like or comment below. We'd love to hear from you guys. Till next time!